<laughs> yeah. Brian Fargo presents Fallout. Maybe oh, that music. Galaxy News. No computer, 800 horsepower, zero to, zero to 60 in seconds, only 1990 99 Corvega. Oh jeez, I've been watching the TV so much I totally wasn't even looking at the background. <laughs> Mr. Handy. changes. The Romans waged war to gather slaves and wealth. Spain built an empire from its lust for gold and territory. Hitler shaped a battered Germany into an economic superpower. But war never changes. In the 21st century, war was still waged over the resources that could be acquired. Only this time, the spoils of war were also its weapons petroleum and uranium. For these resources, China would invade Alaska, the US would annex Canada, and the European Commonwealth would dissolve into quarreling, bickering nation states bent on controlling the last remaining resources on Earth. In 2077, the storm of World War had come again. In two brief hours, most of the planet was reduced to cinders. And from the ashes of nuclear devastation, a new civilization would struggle to arise. A few were able to reach the relative safety of the large underground vaults. Your family was part of that group that entered Vault 13. Imprisoned safely behind the large vault door under a mountain of stone, a generation has lived without knowledge of the outside world. Life in the vault is about to change. I like that wording. Imprisoned safely. Fantastic. It's just, just what we needed. Some safe imprisonment in our lives. Oh, man. It's been so long. Because I have played this before, but it's been a long time. Greetings, game girls and game boys. I'm Contemplate, and today we're playing Fallout. The original Fallout. Uh... I just, uh, I got it, and I wanted to play it. It's because I finally got it running on my computer. My new computer! Woo! Uh, I also wanted to play the first, uh, Morrowind, or sorry, the Morrow. wow, I'm editing that out. I also wanted to play the first Elder Scrolls, which is Arena. So, I have recorded Arena, and soon, hopefully in the next few days, it'll be going on my Patreon. So if you want to see that, you're going to have to pay something and go watch it over there. I'm going to probably do a fairly large playthrough. I don't know if I'll continue playing it. Depends on what my patrons want. Uh, hopefully you can find the link to that, and hopefully it works down in the description, but I won't go on. This is the first freaking Fallout, man. And it's a lazy Sunday, so let's do this. Let's new game. Oh, oh my god. Character. <laughs> I love this. Oh, cool. Uh, 
Uh, I want to play Natalia. Let's let's play Natalia. She's uh, personal bio data. Natalia is the grandchild of a Russian diplomat who worked at the Soviet consult consult consulate. Sorry, Derpadu. Consulate in Los Angeles. She is an excellent acrobat with excellent coordination and reflexes. See, there we go. So basically, she's going to be roguish. Uh, she is extremely intelligent and resourceful. Her only difficulty as a young child was understanding personal property laws. She's a thief! <laughs> Natalia is very interested in leaving the vault and curious to explore the outside world. Ah, oh, Natalia, you're my lady. You're my girl. Can I mod- Ooh, modify- Oh my gosh. Look at these old stats. Uh, what I'm looking at looks pretty decent. What you're seeing is probably pretty friggin' pixelated and greeny, but granted, I'm also seeing a very small version of it on my screen, so. Sorry for the quality. I'm gonna have to even blow it up, because my recording program, like, puts it in this tiny little box. Like, eh, like that. That's where it is on my screen. Anyway. Uh, yeah. Sorry. Anyway, enough talking about that. Let's see. Unarmed, so she's good at punching stuff, sneak and st steal. The, it's not even thievery, it's still, straight up still. Take stuff. All right, straight, you know what? I don't wanna, I don't, age 17. Let's make her legal. <laughs> so she's 18, female. Natalia, can I change her gender? I can, that's dumb. I can even change her name if I wanted to, but they gave us Natalia. I want to play Natalia, because she sounds kind of awesome. Night person and gifted are her traits. What we common uh, wastelanders know as uh, perks. So let's see. Uh, no more points to distribute. Yeah, we're just going to leave all of her stats the same. Okay, done. Ha. Ah, you're here. Good. We've yep. got a problem. A big one. The controller chip for our water purification system has given up the ghost. Can't make another one, and the process is too complicated for a workaround system. Simply okay. put, we're running out of drinking water. No water, no vault. This is crucial to our survival. And frankly, I, I think you're the only hope we have. You yeah, need I am. to go find us another controller chip. We estimate we have four to five months before the vault <laughs> runs out of water. We need that chip. We marked your map with the location of another vault. Not a bad place to start, I think. Okay. Look, just be safe. Okay? Natalia will try to be safe. But we will see. The real question is, will the rest of the world be safe from Natal? <laughs> All these graphics. Oh, snap! Forgot all about these graphics. They're so bad, but so good. All right, here we go. Time, time for some gameplay. I don't remember exactly how to play. Oh, can I search? What I see? You see bones. Search the bones. Cool. Give me those bullets, those ammunitions, and give me those knife. Oh, I have two knives now. Sweet. Let's go. She's currently unarmed. I want to attack this rat. Yeah. Target out of range. Okay. I move there. Let's see, so I have three action points. I've got to relearn the system. So okay, I can't attack right now. So let's. Can I move again? Was that my turn? Was that it? Was that all my HP AC? Uh, I, I guess. What are you doing? Not really sure how to play here, guys. Oh, okay. Then mouse is gonna move or rat. Rad rat. 
Man, rat, you're rad. Let's go to my inventory right quick. Let's make sure this weapon is equipped. Item one. Item two. Is that gun even loaded? Hang on. I know these kind of games to some degree, and they will, like... Oh. Oh. Okay. Can it only hold two bullets? That's so ridiculous. Alright, let's attack this rat. How do I attack? Attack! Looks unhurt. Attack it! 47% chance of hitting. Keep going! Rat murder! Where's my HP? My HP is 31. Come on, rat, die! There we go! Okay, so now can I in can I investigate the rat's corpse? Okay, he's got nothing. Got nothing! Oh, this is so cool. Uh, let's move over here. Any other rats want to rumble? How do we switch items? I want to I wanna use this item. Okay. Screw you, rat! Okay, apparently I had 0% chance of hitting those guys way out there. Unhurt. Okay, so how do we move again? So, yeah, I, I'm not tot totally sure on how to do this. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Here he comes. Point blank. Oh, jeez, and he got an attack on me. How about get screwed, rat? Can I attack him? Attack him! Take that! Boom! Dead rat, dead. Sweet. Alright, I'm actually gonna switch items. How do I switch items? Can I just switch? Ah, let's hurry and save. Why not? Yeah. There we go. Uh, description. Conti. Save. Tube. There we go. Now I know it's for me, and it's a save, and it's for you two. Genius! Alright. Uh, uh, yeah, we're just gonna do all melee here, so. Ba -ba -da -ba. Like, uh, I don't. Like, I don't know how to do, like, anything. Oh, that's how you sneak? I'm sneaking now? Pushing buttons on the keyboard right now. Number one lets me go into sneak mode. Tab gives me the map. That's what I was kind of hoping for. Q. E R A S S brings up my skill index. G F Z Pit Boy not available in combat. Interesting. X C. Oh, cool. There's all my stats. Control function. Oh, okay. So that's gonna be good enough. Let's let's get back into combat. Kind of, kind of figuring this out. Alright, there we go. Now we're... Wait, are we out of battle, or... Are we in battle? Okay. Come on, rat! I'm not scared of you, rat. I'm gonna stab you in the face. Boom! Oh, that's a resilient rat. Oh, he dodged me. There we go. Luckily, I didn't have to freaking do enough jack diddly doo -dah. Okay. No, no, I just wanna search the rat, man. Rat man do. All right, so let's let's go into sneak mode here. I mean, it says sneak. I'm gonna assume I'm sneaking. Uh, sound. Okay. Hopefully, I remember to edit that out, or that'll be really dumb. Let's go get him. Okay, rat. Let's rumble, rat. Rat to rumble. Rumble rats? Is that a sh TV series? Should be. Rat. Hello, where'd you go, rat? Find yourself a nice little hole to hide in, you coward. Rat bastard. Huh? Rat coward. Where'd you go? Oh, there you are. Oh, that's a bit inconvenient. Uh! Did I get him? Yeah. Excellent. Let's search his little rat corpse. He got nothing. Cool. And just go back to movements. Right, you know, I want to go back up here. I want to see what's up here. I guess I'm not sneaking anymore. How do I sneak? There we go. Does that chew up more action points or what? Oh, wow. The world seems alive when I choose to travel a further distance. Since everything's, like, taking its turn to move, the world feels more alive because things are just kind of moving. Oh, snap. Rat spotted me. <laughs> I like this too, this down here, this is so cool. Alright, let's stab this rat up. 
Uh. Oh, he dodged it. Oh, no! Severely wounded, but I didn't kill it. Okay, how do I... Oh, crap. Ah, I'm a butt! You can't just go around biting butts, rat. See what happens? You bite butts, you get stabbed. Like, your parents didn't teach you that? Doesn't look like the rats carry anything. Of course, we all know in the new ones, you can get all kinds of cool stuff off of rats. Like meat. Wait, are there rats? I can't think of any rats in the new ones. That is from, like, three up. Oh, no! Okay, so I think I can move one, and then he'll follow me and bite me. You were hit for four points. Where's my HP? 27? Ah, we're fine! Just gonna murder the hell out of this rat. Okay, I'm probably gonna jump through some of this combat, so yeah, just to warn you. That was cool. Oh man, I can look around! Man, I'm dumb. How did I not know that? Quick! Look! That's how you switch weapons. You just click that little dot. Good to know. <sighs> Alright, killed everything in this area. Now it's time to get boogie and just check this place out. Wish I knew how to, like, run. That'd be cool. This is, like, the, can car the angles of the camera and stuff are so interesting. Like, it's, it's kind of a hard workaround. But... You know, it's an old game, so we're gonna cut it some slack. Wait, does that mean murder? That's that's what I wanted to mean. I don't know if it means the same thing. <laughs> oh, this cave's gonna be a punk butt forever to get through. Alright, I'm slowly learning more and more by pushing more buttons. So we'll sneak through here. Come on, sneak attack. Nope. So when this opens up down here in the lower right hand corner, that's your turn and combat. So you can end your turn or you can try and escape combat. Uh, yeah, these guys are actually really freaking hard to hit. Like, I'm starting to think I just might want to punch them. But yeah. It keeps telling me that I can't do anything else and nothing will move forward, so I can actually end, end my turn. And then he gets his attack, and I don't have to, like, take a step back, you know, turning my back on him. Squeak, he says! <laughs> uh... Okay, and your action points are measured right here, these little green dots. So, let's, uh... I don't have enough action points. How many action points does it take to look at a corpse? Alright. Come on, other rat. Oh, okay. Combat ended. Sweet. Yeah, none of the rats have had anything. Whoa, 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 wait, wait, wait. Did I just see a trench knife in my inventory? Okay, they're just brass knuckles. Give me those brass knuckles. What am I doing with a knife? Like, seriously. Freaking, it's. My character's all about melee combat, so why am I trying to use a knife? Am I in combat? No, I'm not. Oh no, crap, I messed up. Get punched! There we go! See? You gotta utilize your skills in these kind of games, guys! If your character's good at punching stuff, punch stuff! Like, that's a problem a lot of people had with Morrowind, is just how hard combat was. And it's like, it wasn't really extremely hard, it's just that nobody, like, had taken the time to learn how to use the combat system to their advantage. Oh, looks like we're by the exit. Yeah, let's get out of here. Nice. All right, let's see what the wasteland looks like for the first time in Natalia's long life. I mean, short life. Short lo life of length. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoops, okay, cool. So, let's travel here. So, this is the other interesting thing to me. That's how you look around. So, this is where the other uh, fallout shelter is. And then, while you're traveling, combat can happen. 
I'm staying on this mountain range to try and get as much of a view as I can, and I don't know if that actually works to your benefit or not. Up, oh, combat. Boom. All right. What are we facing off with here? You have stumbled upon a family of mole rats. Nice. Ugh. Take that, rat. Oh, my gosh. I just wrecked your day. Oh, jeez. I'm a little bit concerned now. Because he's just taking this beating. This rough beating that I'm just dishing out. Oh. Watch my HP drop. Oh, no. Oh, crap. Okay. Let's... I want to... I want to move one. And I'm going to go back to punching this guy. There we go. That's one down. Can I survive two more hits? Uh, do I even have any healing goods? Dude, they didn't give me any healing goods. I'm like... So oh, okay. No, here they are. Stem pack. How do I use that? Okay. So, if I switch weapons... Use on me. Did I heal? Oh, crap. I think I healed... Hang on. Oh, there we go. Yeah, sorry, I made sound effects from a character. That might have been a little weird. That probably sounded a little bit extremely creepy. All right, you freaking mole rat bastard. Time to get punched in the face for a lot of damage. What? Oh, geez. Let's uh, retreat two moves just to burn through some of his attack. Did that end his turn? Yes. Cool. So I'm going to punch him in the face. Hopefully one move will keep him from getting his double attack. Nope. Oh, man. Oh. Holy. Let's end combat. Jeez, man. Tell me you have healing goods on your corpse. No? No, of course not. Frick, man. Let's see if there's anything in the area real quick. Let's go investigate this. Is there anything to see here? Holy crap, dude. That was intense. Uh, on closer examination, you think these might actually be pieces of petrified wood. See, that's something cool, too. They just they give you all these, like, world-building, like, details. Let's, let's investigate this over here. Or right here, let's not stand right on top of it. Get over here, character. So, I'm having a look around the area. It's a pretty decent-sized playing space. Then we're going to investigate this. Uh, you see bones. You think these might be horned kangaroo bones? Horned kangaroos, huh? But you cannot be sure. They are too weathered to make a final determination. Grandtastic. Let's get out of this area and continue on our quest. All right. So we're going to try and get to this town. Perfect. Desert. Uh, wait, wait, what, 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 what? Um, I thought that there was a city here. Okay, no, fantastic. That, it's a little bit worrisome. No, just go right here. Ah, that, I thought there was a town here. Did, you guys saw the town, right? It just says desert. Crap. And I traveled way far down from where I was supposed to go. And combat. I'm probably going to die. Yep, definitely going to die. Can I run? Yep, I'm just going to run. Because I'm not... I can't face off with two more of these guys. So, oh, cool. Looks like I, I escaped battle. Good. Yeah, I got out of combat our way across these mountains here. That's cool. She kind of stuck to that low point. So let's, let, yeah, let's just head off to this vault and hopefully, wait, what's this? Unknown. What does that even mean? Oh, hello. Okay, so I found the town. I knew there was a town nearby. Like I said, I've played this once before. But yeah, let's, uh, can we talk to this guy? Hey. Do you want to party? If not, put your weapon Unless you want something yada yada yada. There we go. So, let me rephrase what he said. 
You want a party? If not, put your weapon away. Garl Death Hand loves his warriors. Put that thing away. What the junk? I put it away. I, everything's been put away, dude. Calm your jets. Like, take your jets, turn them down to, like, zero, because you need to calm it. Okay. Oh, what a tough one, huh? Girl Death like that. Warriors, put that away and go talk to him. Okay, cool. Hey, you! In there! Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Uh, put that away and talk to him. Okay, okay, where is he? Is this an underwear party in here? I feel like I'm gonna get shot. Can I go can I go through this door? Hello? If I come in here, am I gonna get shot to death? Who are you? You see Garl, leader of the raiders. What do you want? I'm an explorer! We don't like those kind of people. We can't have that here. Kill her! I told you I was gonna die! Uh, and let's begin the running, because I'm pretty sure he's just going to freaking murder. Oh, jeez. Run! Run for your life! Can I close this door? No, no! Close the door! Oh, poop boots. Okay, let's move out of the line of sight, hopefully. Dude, what did I do? Just an adventurer, man! Oh, no... What are you going to do with that sexy walk? Mm, mm, going to murder you. Kill this fool. I don't want to die. No, don't stab me. Owie. <laughs> you suck. You missed. Is it my turn yet? Oh, man. It's the entire camp. I should have saved. Whoops. I don't think that I can get past these guys. And I'm pretty sure I'm about to die. Yep. Oh, oh, it's my turn. Can I can I run? Can I move here? <laughs> I'm running away. And that's my turn. Oh, I'm so boned. Oh, the the eventful life of a vault dweller. Sorry, Natalia. Death! Someone shrieks from across the way. Blunder! Dead. Oh, I just got knocked down, but I'm still alive. With two hit points and dead. Yup. The darkness of the afterlife is all <laughs> that awaits you now. May you find more peace in that world than you found in this one. So there you have it, man. The original Fallout. Uh, obviously a very difficult game. Luckily, I did save just outside of the vault, so if we ever decide to continue, I can at least get us back to about where we were, and I won't have to start completely from scratch. So that's going to be it for this Lazy Sunday. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give the video a big old thumbs up, and uh, make sure to leave a comment in the comment section. I want to read them. I reply to every comment. And that's game over, man. Game over. Oh, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.